What's good? It's your boy KB, Fat Man in the Pig Skin. First episode ever. Chargers fan here. Gonna preview the 2014 season. We just came off a, a very nice draft where we got some players that's really gonna help with speed, with pursuit. We come in full circle. I give us two full off seasons, we be right in the conversations. Peyton Manning getting older. Let's be honest, Alex Smith ain't really got himself nothing at all. The boat's coming up in the game, and Oakland's Oakland. I mean, it's Oakland. Uh, unless I got a time machine, it's Oakland, so I ain't really tripping about Oakland. No matter what, you remember it's Oakland. <laughs> so, if you remember that, we'll be cool. Matt Shop, new players, old players, is Oakland. We don't feel no Oakland. Nah, but as far as this, I'm gonna start on the defensive side of the ball, because that's what we really need to help on the cool. We still need secondary help, but we coming along, man. You remember we was Antoine Casey and Quentin Jamble? We was pretty bad, man. We coming along in the game. I sure hate that uh, Brandon Thomas never worked out, or was it Brandon Taylor? It's Brandon Taylor from uh, LSU, I believe. Fourth, uh, fourth round pick, never worked out. I always hurt, you bastard. Show what you would've panned out. He's still on the team. This might be his last year. Um, Gilchrist is supposed to as our starter, but I hope do or die. AKA Jahil or die. I hope he takes that job. I seen flashes from last year. He was an undrafted dude. He played with a chip on the shoulder. Just thinking of what he can learn playing next to Weddle. AKA, I call Weddle the Mandarin. All that hell, all that, that beard, that fucking mohawk. Man, I love, uh, I love Weddle, man. Call him the Mandarin. You'll never see him coming. Cornerbacks, man. Sharice White showed improvement last year, man. Because at the top of the year, and mind you, you're talking to a guy who's actually went back and reviewed all the Chargers games from last season. I seen what we were. I seen what we weren't. <laughs> Word. I seen what we were not, but um, it's gonna be interesting to see, man. But uh, we got two number twos right now. We still have a number one cornerback, and maybe Barrett will turn into a number one cornerback at the moment. But he's a rookie, so it, like this is not a knock against him. It's just saying he's a rookie, so you can't expect no rookie to come out and be a number one. You just you just can't. And Sharice Wright is nobody's number one, man. He had to help some guys last year to had his lunch. He's a true, true number two. If we, if we can get him another year of development at number two, it would be cool. We got a number three and uh, Steve Williams. A lot of y'all don't know Steve Williams. He's the dude who got hurt early in the year, but uh, he was playing in the nickel. Like, I hope we cut Johnny Patrick. I ain't really cut for Johnny Patrick. I've never really seen nothing that I really like. But uh, that Steve Williams dude, man, he messed around being a true nickel for us or whatever, true, the true uh, third cornerback. But we still need a number one, or we need Verrett to really turn into that number one. I'm really need that big dog. You know what I'm saying? If you can really do that for your boy, that'd be quite live. Linebacker. Actually, our front seven, to be honest, our front seven is missing two things. We're missing health. God damn, man. We need to do something about that. We're missing health. We always hurt. We never have our full front seven going into the season. I mean, like what team does, but we never do, man. Last year, we lost Freeney. We lost Ingram. Butler missed a few games. Shit was real. You know what I'm saying? That's wild, man. That's 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 truly wild. But uh, this year we stacked though, man. We got the Butler did it. He got paid. He could've come out here. Butler gonna be on NFL top 100 next year. You heard it here first, folks. Next to him, Manti Teo. A lot of people really was kind of down on Manti. And I ain't gonna lie, I had high hopes for the kid when he came out and he let me all the way down. But number one, he was a rookie. Number two, he hurt his foot week two. He had surgery, so he's gonna be quick because of my chief complaint, he looked slow side to side, but he got that foot repaired. And then when you look at the tape at the end of the season, he was around the ball. So get a guy a little bit more speed another year, and we're not asking him to be the superstar. That's the butler job. Just go clean up some mess. We still got the Wiley veteran Jared Johnson, who I absolutely love, and I'm gonna hate to see him retire whenever he does. We got, uh, I'm gonna get this right, Jerry Atauchu. Yeah, that's, that's my dude name. Quickest first step since Clowney. On the cool. Um, I don't really know what he got on that strength wise, but we're gonna see. Dude first step and he get to learn from Freeman. And inside we got Kendall Reyes and Corey Legion. We live right there. We do need a D tackle. I like the uh, Ryan Carruthers pick, fifth round pick. I like the dude, uh, got leverage for a dude like that. Y'all remember Jamal Williams? That's what he kind of, well, I'm not gonna say he remind me of that. That's what I'm hoping he can become because he got some strong leverage. He, you know, he ain't the tallest dude at 6'1", but he real strong, so maybe he can do something. Then we still got that mammoth of a dude, Kwame Githers on the uh, bench who uh, I wouldn't want him to develop. He's huge, he's strong as fuck. I don't know, maybe his technique ain't it or whatever. He don't get into much PT, but I don't really see nothing from him. Uh, 
but we we gonna be live on that defense, man. We really need another two, a year or two to continue being up building that secondary because we need some more help, you know. Unless Verrett just shut me up and become that number one sooner than later, you know that'll be live. And Sharice hold down the two with Patrick, uh, not Patrick, but uh, Steve Williams at the three. We'll be live, but defense will work in progress, but we coming along.